I need to stop fucking fiddling with shit, man. Bring me back to my COD days where I'd just be playing with a controller eight hours a day. Alright, this is gonna be a quick mindset video. Just... Yeah. I'll just get straight into it. I've been developing this over time, so... It's still, like, in progress, but... It's a week before New Year's. I'm driving home with my mate, and... We're deciding, like, okay... What are we gonna do for New Year's? Are we gonna go out? Are we gonna drink? Are we gonna... Get really fucked up? And then I stopped. And just looked at him and was just like... What are we celebrating for? There's no actual reason why we're celebrating. We didn't do much that year. And it's not like there's like... There's no actual physical change. It's just a number on a calendar. There's not like a rock in space that represents like, yup, this is the point where Earth passes it that represents one year. There's nothing like that. Of course, I didn't say all of that, otherwise he would have just looked at me as if it was on acid. I only just said to him, yeah, like, why are we celebrating? Why are we going out? What, what's the point? The reason I went on that mini tangent is because... People are letting a man-made creation ruin their lives, run their lives. And it's not alcohol or drugs, it's the calendar. So anyways, fast forward a week, and I am drunk as fuck, in a crowd, numbing the pain to my chest because I recently got heartbroken, in a crowd full of sweaty people looking like they're dressed to go to the beach. When it was cold as fuck. And I was looking around and seeing some people that were mentally on Mars. <sighs> now of course, have fun and all of this shit before you indulge. But just ask yourself this question. Have you earned it? Because I woke up the next day and... I regretted it. It wasn't even that much fun. Yeah, sure, I met new people, but... If I could take it back, I would have. Because I felt like shit for the next few days. I hate alcohol. And that's my whole point. Have you earned it? Have you put in some sort of work with the reward? Do you deserve the reward? Because everyone now is just getting the reward without doing the work. I never give myself weekends. I don't think I deserve them. I'm not even in the financial position that my younger self has set me up for to even consistently pay for gas. Sometimes I'm scraping money through my wallet. I don't think I deserve them. I'm just focusing on my side hustle and fitness. That's all I'm doing. I'm trying to avoid going out. I'm doing all of this shit. Now we can take this to the extreme and say that, well, I don't even celebrate my birthday either. Wow. Congrats, Cade. You passed level one in a first world country. Good shit, bro. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Ugh. It's just that anyone that's been in a massive rut, like myself, multiple times, knows that life doesn't slow down on your birthdays, on Christmas, on Thanksgiving, on Matariki, fucking... All of these holidays, all of these weekends, all of these nights out, life does not slow down for you. The average person now is either... What is it called? Agnostic or an atheist. That is my generation now. The average person doesn't believe in God, but guess what? The God is their calendar. Like, sure, we aren't lazy. Because if someone tells us, yes, be here, I'll pay you 50 bucks to work for two hours, we will do the work and we will have a decent work rate. Sure. But as soon as the two hours are up, everyone is fucking lazy. They work super hard during the week and they build up this emotional high that peaks on Saturday. And it's like, boys, yes, it's fucking Saturday, finally. The Warriors are playing, let's get fucked up, let's go out. And then Sunday comes. <laughs> Sleep through their alarm. It's 11am. They have this booming headache. And they feel like shit. And then they realise, oh, fuck. I've got work tomorrow. And then they just do it again. It's like a record player that repeats every seven days. The truth is, if you're watching videos like this, if you're watching anyone else's videos or my videos, 
you are fucking terrified of that. What I just described, my experience with New Year's, you were terrified of that. Okay, so I'm just editing this part and I've finished recording, whatever. But I just want to say the way you actually avoid it is by avoiding addictions. That's the main part, the most easiest way. Is because, like, if you're addicted to a video game, let's say the new GTA 6. Let's fast forward to next year, I think in June or July, or maybe April, whatever. GTA 6 is out. You're playing it, and you're playing it every single night. But you are now at work, and you're thinking about GTA 6. That's how you're going to get sucked into this trap. The calendar effect is that you are just living for the weekend. You are hating five days of your life to live for the two. And I'll even go so far to say that I'm not even going to be dating. I'm not where I want to be in life. And it's just selfish of me to even involve myself with a girl. Because I'm not where I want to be. I'm too obsessed. It's too distracting and... If I don't achieve what I want to achieve, then I could end up blaming it on her. I don't want to do that. Yeah. <laughs> this shit could just sound like coke, but... Oh. Uh, anyways, back to the actual recording of the video. So, I am living as if I'm in the military, pretty much. Minus the training and the push-ups. But I'm waking up at 5am every morning. Either on Monday or Sunday. What's the time? It's 7.27 a.m. on a Sunday morning, and I just went for like a 6K run, scripted this, now I'm recording. It doesn't matter, I'll be doing this on a Monday. But, you don't need to be as extreme as me, obviously. I just truly believe that in the internet and internet businesses and all of this shit, you need to wake up early, or stay up later and work when no one else wants to work. Work when no one else is awake, so then you're unbothered. It truly depends on what you want to achieve, but I want to achieve greater things than my peers. I'll just be honest with it. My name is Kate Andrews. I'm going to move to more entertainment-based, well, self-improvement-based entertainment content once I'm good with a camera. Until then, I'm just going to be doing videos like this for now. Hopefully, just a couple more months. I'm still learning. Don't do what's easy, do what's right. Peace.